Big time handicap match underway here. He goes for the cover. Only a two count. Wow. Beautiful technique. Starting to show signs of fatigue. I don't know about you, but I don't like his chances of survival here in this handicap match. Well, this certainly escalated in a hurry. I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly. Hurricane Rana! What a Hurricane Rana! Oh, nasty impact. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Not too early for that. This might be it! Oh, my! And a steam. Harsh impact. Root has really thrived on the main roster, guys. Into the quick cover. An easy kick out there. He just powered out there, Cole. Looks like he's starting to falter. He's been taken to the limit here in this handicap match. Hey, while he might not want to hear it now, sometimes there are positives that he'll take from a beating like this. Oh, nasty impact. As Michael mentioned, Bobby Roode defeated Jinder Mahal in the grueling finals of the United States Championship. And he doesn't stay down for long. Yeah, he's not done yet. We've seen handicap matches throughout WWE history that can display someone's incredible ability. And we've seen the handicap match be utilized to deliberately put someone in less than advantageous situation. Either way, handicap matches are something that a superstar must be ready for no matter what side of the numbers game they're on. He's looking at it. No matter what era of WWE history we look at, or if we're talking about present day. Ooh, what impact. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Things just went from bad to worse for Bobby Roode. Uh, going to the top. High risk. Look at this. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. To be a success at this level, gentlemen, you have to believe in yourself. And when I look at Bobby Roode, I see a superstar who simply oozes confidence. Dig it deep for a kick out. What a glorious kick out for Bobby Roode. Oh boy, he is rolling. As Corey noted, Root is a guy who thinks quite highly of himself. But Byron, some might say his level of confidence is bordering on arrogance. Yeah, but when you look at the hit list, he's going for the pin. When this guy's on, look out. And he's able to get out. Wow. 
Now that's a display of excellent ring awareness. Nicely done. Oh, watch out. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Corey, what does an opponent have to do in order to be successful against Bobby Roode? Well, Cole, when I finally see somebody truly be successful against Bobby Roode, I'll let you know. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Oh. His shoulders are down. And he got a near fall out of it. And the match continues. Larian. You know, Byron, Corey makes a great point. Not too many superstars have been successful against Bobby Roode. Yeah, that's what makes him so difficult to really game plan for. There's just no established blueprint for success when it comes to competing against Bobby Roode. Boom, what impact! Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. A handicap match is the type of match where a superstar or superstars. What are you doing here, Corey? I don't think he's got it completely locked in. And he breaks free just when you thought he was out of this one. Showing off some of his speed there. Handicap matches have been part of the WWE for decades. The superstar who's seen the most handicap matches out of anyone is the iconic eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. Andre took on teams of two, three, and four men at a time. The Giant's opponents could be in the ring at the same time, where one man is in the ring and the team members are on the ring apron, similar to the traditional tag team contest. Handicap matches are some of the most unpredictable matches in sports entertainment. The great Andre the Giant traveled... He might have it. Beautiful technique. So impressive. Throughout WWE's more than 54-year history, there's one superstar who raises their game even higher in a handicap match. It's the superstar with the motto, one versus all, and that's the big dog, Roman Reigns. On the February 20th, 2017 episode of Monday Night Raw, we saw Reigns accept the handicap match against the Raw Tag Team Champions, Anderson and Gallows. DDT! That night on Raw, Roman Reigns was determined to take down Anderson and Gallows. What I found more impressive than taking Anderson and Gallows on was that Reigns did so right before he squared off against Braun Strowman in Fastlane. The big dog never rests. Roman Reigns is happy to take on anyone who thinks the WWE ring is their yard. Look, I'll never dismiss the power, determination, and ability of Roman Reigns. I've been in the ring with the man. The match ended because Roman took it upon himself to attack Anderson and Gallows with a steel chair, which in my mind was done without just cause and is something I don't condone. What a stomp! Good grief! He's looking a little weary here. This is not where he wants to be right now, guys. Listen to this crowd. They can see this handicap match is starting to slip away from him here. In a back-and-forth match like this, he has to do everything in his power not to let his opponent gain too much momentum here. Hurricane Rana! Unbelievable athleticism. You gotta believe this one's over. And that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. In 2017, the WWE Universe saw the immeasurable power of Braun Strowman unleashed in handicap matches. The monster among men annihilated teams of two, three, and four men and made it look so easy it was almost difficult to comprehend. On the February 6th episode of Monday Night Raw, the Leviathan, Braun Strowman, absolutely destroyed four local competitors and made it look like child's play. Corey, I remember when we called the action that night on Raw and Braun Strowman was simply unstoppable. The easiest way to put it is that Braun Strowman doesn't care if he's in the ring against Logan. Looking at it here. He's making a statement here with this attack. This just ain't gonna do it. 
He fights his way free. But how much energy did he exhaust fighting his way out? Nailed it. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. for that. And a pin attempt. And Elias avoids the early pin. Not yet. Throughout WWE's more than 54-year history, there's one superstar who raises their game even higher in a handicap match. It's the superstar with the motto, he's got the shoulders down. Yeah, I don't believe that, that he didn't win this match right there. Tried for it early. That night on Raw, Roman Reigns was determined to take down Anderson and Gallows. What I found more impressive than taking Anderson and Gallows on was that Reigns did so right before he squared off against Braun Strowman at Fastlane. The big dog never rests. Roman Reigns is happy to take on anyone who thinks the WWE ring is their yard. Look, I'll never dismiss the power, determination, and ability of Roman Reigns. I've been in the ring with the man. The match ended because Roman took it upon himself to attack Anderson and Gallows with a steel chair, which in my mind was done without just cause and is something I don't condone. I'll never forget Elias' sad attempt to return after his defeat in a Loser Leaves NXT match against Cassius Ohno. Just a few weeks later, we were introduced to the masked competitor, El Vagabundo. He's calling for it. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. He's making a statement here with this attack. Big slam. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. Yeah, you don't see a slam like that very often. Schoolboy! These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Ah, oh, here it comes! Sit down, pile driver! When this guy's on, look out. <laughs> wow, what a gritty performance. Now he's working that exploit. Nailed it. What a comeback. He's got it. Let's see it once more. Yeah, this match is all but over. Six. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. Here we go. Back inside the ring. Oh, man. Young gets out of the way there quickly. Just a step quicker, it looks like. Suplex! Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Here's the cover. Two! 
two. He kicks out before three. Oh, man, I don't know who to root for. Oh, man, Young gets out of the way there quickly. There's got to be some point in the match where those thoughts start to creep in that it could be over. And then you got to dig down deep, get rid of the self-doubt, and continue on toward victory. Smart strategy, attack the knee. When this guy's on, look out. Oh, what a knee strike. Oh, my goodness. There's the oh. knee right to the face. Oh. Man. Elias looking very beaten right now. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. It's not the end of the song for Elias. Just yet, guys. Goes down hard. Going for it all here. Is he done? Oh, somehow he breaks it. He may have broken free cold, but I assure you the damage has already been done. It's safe to say he had his opponent well scouted there. Brilliant analysis, Saxton. At what point do those thoughts creep in of, what do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. Oh, nasty impact. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. We have seen him here before. Ooh, what impact. Now it's time to capitalize. Great move by him right there. Yeah, let's see that one again. Took him out at the knee. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. This could do it! Uh-oh. One, two, kick out at two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. He's going for the pin. This could be it! Into the pay window. He kicks out before three. He's got some more fight in him, guys. Bad move there. I don't know what made him think that was a good idea. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Here's a cover. Could be it. Two. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. How'd he do that? Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Harsh impact. <laughs> Big boot. Big time takedown right there. This might just be it for him, Michael. He's got him covered. Two. True testament to grit. Oh, there's still a chance that we'll hear more from Elias. Is it really that bad? Flash. We got a cover. One. This might be it. Oh, my. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Oh, what a splash. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. Penny predicament. One, two. Oh, that was a close call. Still in it. Hurricane Rana. Beautiful technique. A 
quick reversal by Elias. Hurricane Rana! Hurricane Rana! Oh boy, he is rolling. trouble. Now he's working that exploit. Oh, what impact! Here's his moment, Michael. We're going to take another look at this. I can watch this move over and over. One, two! And he got a near fall out of it. Wow, I thought for sure that was it. Drew's got the pump handle hooked. Focused attack on the back. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. He's got to be running on empty at this point. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? What a match this has been, guys. And it's starting to look like these superstars are beginning to feel the effect. He can pin his opponent right here. Oh, I can't believe he had the energy to kick out of that. How'd he do that? This is what makes him one of the best in the business. This might be it. Oh, my. Takes him down hard. You gotta love that kind of aggression. Putting it all on the line. I don't know how much more these superstars can take, guys. You'd have to think something's got to give here soon. And if he hits this, this one's over. It'll destroy your face. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. He's in trouble. Here he goes. You've got to believe this one's over. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Here he goes for the win. Two, three. The pinfall and the victory. That's what makes a handicap match one of the most unpredictable in WWE. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic.
from the opening bell, this match was one for the ages. I'm almost speechless. Almost. Here is your winner, Buddy Murphy. Gonna feel the effects of this win for a while. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest, being pinned is humiliating. We may be in New Orleans tonight, but I assure you there was nothing easy about that win right there.